What a wonderful time to be before God. Hallelujah. You know I'm going to be one of Asante. Asante. Hallelujah. Hey, hallelujah. Bwana ametupigania. Hallelujah. We want to say my Bwana ametupigania. Hallelujah. Mafuta ikaongezeka, Bwana akatupigania. Hallelujah. Hali kama mbaya Bwana akatupigania. Hata wakati huu Bwana anatupigania. Hallelujah. Ni wangapi wanaamini Bwana anatupigania? Hata wakati huu mgumu Bwana anatupigania. Hallelujah. Hey. Hallelujah. Amen. Hey, 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 hey. Let me tell you what I saw last night. Angapi wataka kujua what I saw. Hey, 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 hey. Wow, wow, wow. Let me tell you. Last night I had a dream. I don't dream all the time. I dream rarely. Hallelujah. Hey, hey. But last night I had a very wonderful dream. Hallelujah. And I saw Abba dance. Abba dance. Yani nikaona watu wanabeba, wanabeba, wana Hey. Walikuwa wanabeba, vitu wanabeba. Walikuwa wanabeba na anything. Mwili baro, mwili kati, e, tuku tuku. Hallelujah. They were carry. Hallelujah. I pick it. I release it. In the next few months, they will be habadas. In the name of Jesus, they will be habadas. Hallelujah. They will be habadas. Hallelujah. Mambia mwazaku kutakuwa, jipange, jipange. In fact, one of the problems I saw in the dream was administration was lacking. Administration. There was so much. But what was lacking was how to administer it. Hallelujah. I woke up and told mama we need to tighten administration. Because Abba dance is coming. Hallelujah. Hey, hey. Tell your neighbor you need to tighten your accounting system. Administration. Hallelujah. Because Abba dance is coming. Abba dance is coming. You need to tighten your administration. Hallelujah. Praise the name of Jesus. Usipoteze zingine jihani. Kwa thali liona zingine zikipotea jihani. Because there was no administration. Hallelujah. Praise the name of Jesus. In the next four months. Hey, hey, hallelujah. September, October, November, December. I say Abadas. Turning point. Turning point. Hey. Hallelujah. Hey. Hallelujah. Hey. Hallelujah. Jipanke Vizuri. Hallelujah. Tell your neighbor they will be about that. Hallelujah. Praise the name of Jesus. Amen. Are you ready? Amen. I want to preach now. Then we give the offering at the end. Amen. Can we open our Bibles? When you are standing like that. I'm only going to read one book today. Only one book. Hebrews. Chapter 12. Hallelujah. I had somebody saying, I want to go early for lunch. I'm releasing you early for lunch. Amen. I know some of you have a lunch date. Amen. Don't worry. I'm just finishing. By the grace of God. Hebrews chapter 11, chapter 12. Is where I'm going to preach today. Is, this, is it the last Sunday of the month? Second last. Eh? The last Sunday of the month. On Saturday it will be when? 30th. So today I'm finishing the month. Hey, hallelujah. I felt like that. That's why, hallelujah. I don't know the calendar. I never checked it well, but hallelujah. Turning point. We are finishing this today with turning point. And the chapter 12 is a turning point journey. 
is a turning point journey. I want to highlight a few things there. And then we pray in the name of Jesus. You go and do your homework at home. Hello, if you don't do homework, your problem. Hallelujah. Amen. Chapter 11 is a story of people who experience turning points. Hallelujah. Chapter 11 is what? A story of men and women who, who achieved what? Turning points. Is in historia. Ya wale ambao walifikia hali ya maimba yao ikabadilishwa kupikia imani. Hallelujah. And the chapter 12 is ours. Say it's ours. Hallelujah. Chapter 11 is for Abraham and Daniel. Who else? And the Moses and the Sarah. Hey, hey. Sarah is also here. Okay. For Sarah. Hallelujah. Amen. What does he feel? Glory to God. But the chapter 12. Ni yetu sasa. Iyo ni sasa yetu. Hallelujah. Now, let us read verse 1. And then I read and then we sit. Then I give you a few highlights. Today I'm just giving you highlights. Hallelujah. Amen. Praise God. Wherefore seeing we are compassed about, we saw great cloud of witnesses. Let us lay aside every weight and sin which does easily beset us. Let us run with patience the race that is before us, looking to Jesus, the author and the finisher of our faith, over the joy that was set before him. He endured the cross, despising the shame, and he sat down at the right hand of the throne of God. Father, I speak, pray that you will bless your word, even as we are lighted in Jesus' name. Amen. I want the worship leaders to remain there. Amen. You remain there today. You can sit. Hallelujah. The worship leaders are going to remain because we are to worship just now. Hallelujah. Praise God. They are going to stand very upright like the Messiah men. Hallelujah. You know the Messiah can, can stand. Masai wanaza kusimama hivi. Kwa di masaa hivi. Wanasimama anga hivi. Sidiyo. Hallelujah. So these are our Messiahs today. Buana asifiwe. Amen. Buana asifiwe. How are we together? Tuko pamoja. Nita mix kiswaili na kizungu. Diyo kila mutu wapate. Hallelujah. Kama we ni mgeni mara ya kwanza, inuwa mkono tukufamu tu. You are a visitor for the first day. Just raise your hand like this. Just inuwa mkono tu. Usiangushe, usiangushe. Weka mkono ju. Usiangushe mkono, weka tu hivo tu. Na ufanya hivi. Hameona wasichana wengine pale. Wainuwa mkono, usiogope, atuta wampia usebe chochote. Amen. Hallelujah. Just get that card and fill it. And after we finish, you will uh, take tea together by the grace of God. Hallelujah. We are also blessed to see others who have been away for some time. But they are here. Wako hapa. Tutaonana baadai. Hallelujah. Amen. Safari ya turning point. Safari ya turning point. Iko hapa. Iko hapa sasa. Hallelujah. Indio safari. I had some people asking me, Bishop, how can I attend the turning point? And the, this whole chapter, the whole of chapter 12, is a narration of the turning point. Hallelujah. The Bible says that we have a witnesses of people that have gone before us. You know what we call it? Hallelujah. Yani kuna wale, wali, 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 they already attained their turning point. Hallelujah. And they, are, they have already gone ahead of us. Chapter 11, they are the witnesses. Kama wataka kuona wale witnesses wako chapter 11. Wale ambao wana Tanzania na sisi, we come to a turning point of our ministry, of our life, of our family, of our businesses. Hallelujah. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Inuwa mkono hivi. Nataka kukuambia kuna wale, wale walienda mbele. Hile unafanya saa hii, si ati hii kufanywa. Mambia mwenzako, hile unafanya saa hii, si kumkwamba hii kufanywa. 
Haleluya. Ilifanywa na watu wakafanya nini? Wakafaulu. Kama ni huduma walifanya na wakafanya nini? Wakafaulu. Kama ni biashara walifanya wakafanya nini? Wakafaulu. Kama ni kama ni hali ya masomo walisoma wakafanya nini? Wakafaulu. Kama ni uimbaji waliimba wakafanya nini? Wakafaulu. Bwana asifiwe. Na ziwa Biblia inasema there are witnesses. Hallelujah. We have witnesses. We have angels also who are witnessing. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Tell your neighbor you have a witness every day. You are not alone. Eh eh. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. The other day the Lord was speaking to me about angels. Angels. And the Lord said to me, you know, angels are with you every time. They are with you. Dangerous. Tell your name, dangerous. Dangerous. Because angels they do two things. They protect you and also they report to heaven what you are doing. They do what? They also report to heaven. <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. So the Bible says that we have seeing we have also compassed about with a great cloud of witnesses. Let us set aside. Come up if we are going to come to our turning point. There are things we must set aside. Hallelujah. There are things we must set aside and uh, I just want to bring them up here. Set aside. One of them is every weight. Some of us are carrying too much. Hallelujah. Say hallelujah. Hey hey. One time nilikuwa kwa committee kama kumi. Committee ya mazishi nilikuwa huko. Amen. Nilikuwa committee ya shule. Nilikuwa committee ya ya ma wedding. Nilikuwa ma committee. Hey, hallelujah. Hey, bwana asifiwe. Hata nilikuwa kwa committee ya ila inaitwa eh nyumba kumi. Hallelujah. In my where I was to stay in Adams. Nilikuwa tena kwa hiyo committee. Hallelujah. Tena niko kwa niko 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 committee. Hallelujah. Of uh, of uh, evangelistic team which was preaching in Eastern Eastern Kenya. Hallelujah. Niko kwa hiyo. Hallelujah. Amen it used to be called time redeeming ministry niko kwa hiyo committee tena niko kwa committee nyingine ya nyumbani ya cousins hallelujah bwana asifiwe hallelujah i had so many things which were around me i could not make it i could not make it bwana asifiwe and the lord told me if you are going to make it you must shed some things you have some things you have I am going to make sure that you don't make your to your turning point. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Hallelujah. And the Bible says here that there are weights, there are things you carry which are weights and unnecessary weights. And in some of us are not going to make it to our turning point. Tuko na mambo mengi sana. Tumebeba. Hallelujah. Inaona mikono hivi. Juzi kuna mtu mwingine alinialika kwa committee nyingine ya ajabu ya kupeleka dawari. Hadi ni yani ako huko Kitui ati mimi ni join committee yake ya kupeleka dawari. Mike, can you imagine? Hallelujah. Bwana asifiwe. Anakaribisha bishop mzima wa dunia. Ha. I'm also warning you because you may also put me in your committee. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Hallelujah. Amen. Bwana Yesu ni mwema. You lazima uamue na uwe focus on some few things. If you are going to make it in life, there are many things you must shed out of your life. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Kuna jua kuna watu ambao hawataweza hii maisha. Kwa sababu hawa ni ma professional mourners. Masisha hapa na pale lazima hiyo waende. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. I love you. 
but you don't have to go for all the barriers. Tell your neighbor, you don't have to go through all the barriers. You have to go to cousin of your grandmother and also the body. Hey! Hallelujah! Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Hallelujah! There are many things that are holding Africans. Have you ever known why Africans don't succeed? Africans want to be a village, a village, a village, a village, a village, a Hallelujah! Kuna ingine wa meka kwa kichwa, kuna ingine wa nabeba na mgongo. Hallelujah! They are waste. And they make us, they make you not be able to come to your turning point. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. The Bible says, since we are crowd surpassed by compassed, let us lay aside every weight. Wait. Hallelujah. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Sema hallelujah. Sema hallelujah. Lazima ujue saa ya kusoma ni lini. Amen. Usome ukiwa mjanga. Hallelujah. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Usibebe weight nyingi sana. Kuna watu saa hii they don't know what they want in life. They don't know what they want in life. Some of them want to become preachers. They also want to become hallelujah village elders. Hallelujah. They also want to become politicians. Hallelujah. What do you want to become? There are things you need to put aside. And a politician told me, I want you to become, to be in my committee. I want to become a governor. Hallelujah. I told him on, on, consul, on consultant terms, not on meeting. I can come only one day just to, to give you an advice as a man of God. Hallelujah. One as if he were, but I cannot sit in your committee. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Hey, hallelujah. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. There are many people who will never become anything because they don't know of the Bible says that you have to put away some weight. Kuna vitu nyingi umebeba. And as much as you want to make it to your turning point, hautafikia, hautafikia mambo pale unaenda kwa sababu umebeba vitu nyingi sana. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Kuna mambo mengine ya kuacha. Kwa haleluya. Hata Yesu wakati alikuwa hapa duniani kuna mtu mmoja alimwambia Yesu kuja ukanigawie ukanigawainishe shamba mimi na Can you imagine the people can even make you they want even want Jesus to be a kaba savea atienda kawagani hey Bwana Yesu asifiwe. If you have not chosen what you want in life people can make you anything. Hallelujah. People will call you. I have a party for my dog. Hallelujah. You can ask come for a party of their dog. Hallelujah. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Eh eh. Bwana Yesu asifiwe tuko pamoja. Hallelujah. Amen. Other people will call you. Sijui inaitwaje? Eh inaitwa ngo wa mama. Ile mnaenda kufanya wash inaitwaje? Eh? Eh? Baby shower. You know baby shower. I don't know what it is but I I I hope. <laughs> and you also want to welcome Reverend Minnie for baby shower. Bwana asifiwe. Hallelujah. Hey. Hallelujah. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. You can, you can imagine there are people who can never be in a weekend in the city. They can never be even available for any meeting of the church. Because this weekend, the uko. Bile weekend, the uko. Hile weekend, ingine. Hey, hey. Hallelujah. Mwambia mwezako, punguza mambo. Punguza. Punguza. Punguza mambo. Bwana asifiwe. Utakufa mapema. Bwana asifiwe. Hallelujah. Amen. You need to only do things which are on your line of business. On your line of what? Business. Hallelujah. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. And the things that can add value to your turning point. Hallelujah. Praise the name of Jesus. Anything which the Lord add value to the turning point, you need to leave it. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Amen. I don't have time. I will have spend more time. But first thing, if you are going to make it, the journey of turning point 
is you need to punguza mambo, punguza mambo, punguza mambo. Yani, remain with only three things. Eh? At a present, sema mambo ni mata. Yeah, just remain with three things. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Like me, I have only three things in life. One is God. Hallelujah. <laughs> Two, eh? God and ministry. One, that is one. God and ministry. Two, hallelujah. Yeah. Two, family. Yeah. Not, not everybody. Not, 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 not the clan. Just family. Hallelujah. <laughs> three business. Three things. I only do three things in this world. Three things only. Hallelujah. If you call me along those three things, I will come. Outside there, no, I'm not coming. The other day someone was telling Bishop, we were looking for you in the, in the, the feast which was in Kasarani. Really? You're looking for me? I was also having another feast. But that one, that one was in my house. Hallelujah. Praise God. I cannot go to this meeting, come from that meeting, go to the other one, the other one, the other one. Hallelujah. Father Jesus, as if you were. Punguza mambo, my friend. You don't have a future life. You are living in the present. Are you understanding? Hakuna maisha ingine umeka store. Hama umeka, kuna ingine umeka store. Unajua kuna wadu wanakanga kama kuna maisha ingine umeka store. Hile wanakula zaai na kuna ingine store. Hallelujah. You have only one life. What else was if you So, that is first. The second thing, which you are, if you are going to reach to a turning point, sin. The Bible says, put away, wait, and watch. Sin. Hallelujah. What else if you Sin will hinder you from getting to a turning point. Sin will hinder you. Hallelujah. Praise the name of Jesus. Sin will hinder you. I don't want to spend a lot of time, but I, the Lord has been speaking. There are many people who are never going to get to their destiny. Hallelujah. One else was if you were. Say hallelujah. Kuna waze wengine wengi sana. Wakutoka kwetu na kutoka kwenu. Walifanya Nairobi hapa. Sidiyo, miaka mingi. Kule Kenya le Luis. Hallelujah. Na waku jenga nyumba hapa Nairobi. Sidiyo. Kwa sababu hapa Nairobi waliweka mistress, ndio? Ndio. Ndio. Hapa mnasema aje pesa zake zote akapeleka kwa wapi? Mistress. Hallelujah. Let me tell you sin will hinder you from your turning point. Hallelujah. Amen. Kama saa hii ningekuwa na mistress watano, ningekuwa nimejenga nyumba. Na unajua mistress wa Nairobi wako na tumbo kubwa. <laughs> Hallelujah! Hey! Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Tuko pamoja. Amen. What when the owner wanasema bishop, you are doing very well. I'm doing very well because I dealt with the sin. I don't touch sin. Hallelujah! Bwana Yesu asifiwe. I don't touch alcohol. Eh? Kama ningekuwa na kunywa wine kidogo. Ningekuwa nimejenga nyumba, Bwana asifiwe. Kuna watu, one of my my relative was telling me, "Unajua mimi bishop, ile pombe nimekunywa ni kama ngari tano. Nimekunywa ngari ngari tano. Na sasa inatembeanga na miguu. Nikamwambia na zangu naendesha. Ngari zangu naendesha, zako ulifanya nini? Ulikunywa." Hallelujah. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Sin will hinder you from your turning point. I am telling you. If you practice sin. Hallelujah. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Ukiwa msichana, uki practice sin, utapewa watoto watatu na wanaume tofauti 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 na hakuna mtu atalea mmoja. You are very bright, but by the time you raise three children alone, Meno itakuwa imeisha, thamiyaka itakuwa imeisha. 
Sina ubaya na wewe lakini lazima ikuambie ukweli. Dhambi itakumaliza. Haleluya. Kama hutaacha dhambi maisha yako itaisha. There are many people today ulisikia mwingine juzi ni mkubwa wa hospitali kubwa hapa ameuawa na msichana wa Kibera. Sasa wewe fikiria Nairobi hospital na Kibera. What is the relationship between Kibera and Nairobi hospital? Mwana mbona mnapatana wapi sasa? Kama si dhambi. Na mimi hata nilikuwa nakaa Adams na mimi niko hai tu. Hallelujah. Bwana la wao watu wa Kibera wanawana wakatikuwa hapo tu. Lakini hatukupatana kwa wapi? Kwa dhambi. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Hallelujah. You cannot talk about turning point if you are still entertaining sin in your life. Somebody called Samson never go to his turning point because of what? Sin. Ha ha, let me finish. Then go quickly. Then what does he say? Then let us run with what? Let us run with the turning point is a game of speed. You have to run. If you are going to make your turning point, you have to do what? To run. Number two, number four, you have to run with what? Patience. Patience is required. Hallelujah. Some of us have been in this city for long, but we are, hey, hallelujah. One day, one day, hallelujah. We run the race with patience. Patience. One day, eh? one day, Bishop was working somewhere. Then I left. Then I met one brother and I that brother I met him 10 years ago. I met him last week. So he told me, "Bishop, you know, I remember that day when you left. I was panicking for you. I was panicking for you." I said, "Why are you why are you panicking?" I said, "Alikuwa anafikiria umeisha." Nikamwambia alafu akaniambia lakini that day you told me something I'll never forget. You told me you have not seen the last of bishop. You have not seen the last of me. Tell your neighbor you have not seen the last of me. Naweza kuwa nimeisha lakini you have not seen the last of me. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. We have been running this race patiently. Then he race to turning point is a race of patience. Hakuna kitu utakuja utafanya kesho itoke kesho. But you must persist on in patient. Hallelujah. No business you will do and succeed tomorrow. But you must remain there in patience. Turning point will come. Hallelujah. But you must be in patience. Hallelujah. Mwambie mwanzo patient is required. Mwambie tena patient is required. Mwambie ya tatu patient is required. Hallelujah. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Eh? This week another another pastor told me I asked him, mshirika ule wako alikuwa anaitwa so and so alienda wapi? Akaniambia mshirika aliniambia sasa mimi naona tu nimekuwa nikitoa fungu la kumi last one year na mimi naona tu niendelea kutoa fungu la kumi maisha yangu inaenda chini naenda chini naenda chini na mimi natoa fungu la kumi nikaona nitoke sasa umeenda wapi ameenda wapi hallelujah sasa amerudi kule kwa wachawi wa, wa wamsaidie bwana asifiwe things of god are not six si casino ati unaweka inatoka naweka inatoka hallelujah bwana yesu asifiwe There must be patient. There must be patient. Kwa na mimi kama sisi wana tulikuja hapa lini? Tulikuja hapa kare lini? Wana tulikuja lini? Hallelujah. Nitaweza kuletea picha ya Reverend Miriam when we came here. She was a slim girl. Very nice. If you think you are nice, she was better. <laughs> Hallelujah. Lakini hapa chuma kupiga chuma kupiga kupiga kupiga. Hallelujah. Mwana Yesu asifiwe patience. There must be patience. 
Hallelujah. He may never be patient. Lazima ukafumilie leo kesho, kesho kutwa. Hallelujah. Because something must happen. Turning point is for those who are going to be patient. Tell your neighbor patient. Watu wengine wanaanza biashara ya kuuza chapati. Wanauza wiki moja kama ya ingizi, wanaanza kuuza jugu next week. Jugu kama stoki. <laughs> kama jugu <wa> stoi. <laughs> Hallelujah. Ameanza kuanza kuuza pilo. Hallelujah. Bwana asifiwe. Hey. Kaa kwa jugu, kaa kwa wajibu wadao, kaa kwa jugu. Mungu atakucha, hallelujah. Kaa hapo tu, mwana atakucha, be patient. Hallelujah. Praise the name of Jesus. Glory to God. That's why Africans are not turning to their point. Me, I saw, niliona wa, wa indi wakiuza sukari nguru. Wanafungua subui, wanaza sukari nguru. Wanafungua jioni, wanaza sukari nguru. And badai... Now go to Westland. Now they are building what? Skyscrapers. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Hallelujah. Praise the name of Jesus. We are still in chapter 2, chapter 12. I'm about to finish. Let us run with patience the rain that is before us. Hallelujah. The race that is before us. Everybody has their race. You have your race. Tell your neighbor you have your race. Understand your race. Come on, you are going to get to the turning point. You have to understand what? You are race. Hallelujah. Me, I'm running a global race. I don't know about your race. Hallelujah. But you, the Lord has called you for a race. You have your area. Stay in your area. What we think the problem is, they are running this race. Run your race. Hallelujah. Praise the name of Jesus. You know, I'm going to call me, I'm being around in my race. The Lord told me in this place here, you connect me to the nations in this place here. He told me just here. So I ran this one. Amen. I'm not in a hurry. I didn't go to Kasarani. I didn't do meeting. No, no. Me, I'm just running this race. Hallelujah. Bishop, why don't we do Kikom? No. Run my race. See your mama ni kuhapa. Ata ukienda. Mwambia mwazaka ata ukienda after three months. Urudu. Nakuta bishop wapa tu. I'm still running what? My race. Hallelujah. I know God will do something. You may go, but somebody else, God will send somebody else. I preach to them. And I know the seed will fall on a good soil one day. And it will bring blessing in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Amen. The other number, the number the other one says chapter verse 2. Looking to Jesus. Looking to Jesus. If you are going to get to your, to your turning point. You must be focused. Focus on Jesus. Focus on Jesus. Tell your neighbor, focus on Jesus. Focus on Jesus. Don't focus on Ruto. Don't focus on Raila. Don't focus on Bishop. Don't focus on your clan. Don't focus on, on your neighbor. Focus on who? Jesus. Hallelujah. Focus on Jesus. Let your focus be on Jesus. Hallelujah. The author and the finisher. There is one who began and the one who finish. The one who began. He has also science on how to finish. The one who began has got the power to finish. The one who began has got enough understanding on how to finish. Look into Jesus. The author and the finisher. There is a one who is the author. And there is one who is the finisher. We have to look to him. What else was he Kama nikekua naangalia watu, nikekua nimefunga kanisa zamani. 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 What else was he I'm not looking at you. Amen. That's why even when you decide to go, I don't even announce. Because I'm not looking at you. We are only looking at who? Is Jesus there? I am looking to him, the one who called me. The author, the finisher of my faith. The one who called me. The one who is able to keep me from falling. The one who died on the cross. The one who knows my tomorrow. The one who has got the scroll. The one who has the book 
The one who has an understanding of the call. The one who has the, who has the manual. The one who has got the understanding. The one who is able to help me from folly. I'm looking to him. Hallelujah. Hey, hallelujah. The one who is able to turn the water into the wine. Hallelujah. I'm looking to Jesus. Don't look at the economy of this world. If you look at the dollar, you will not start business. Looking to Jesus. Looking to Jesus. The other. Don't look at the competition. Everybody can sell per amende, but yours can go. Is it it? Looking to Jesus, the author and the finisher of our faith. Looking to him. It's not about how other churches are doing. Don't do, that is not my problem. My problem is I'm looking at Jesus. Jesus tell me, keep moving on. You are doing well, my son. I'm happy with your progress. Looking to Jesus, the author and the finisher. If you are going to turn to, finish, to get your turning point, keep your eyes focused. Keep your eyes focused. People who finish the race, who get to the turning point are focused. Tell your neighbor you need to have a focus. You need to have a focus. Hallelujah. See, heavy, 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 heavy. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Ukienda town, ha, eh? When I was young, niliambua kuna watu wanaenanga na ngari isle zinaja. Hallelujah. Ukienda town, kwa machakos country bus, hey, hey. Hapo unaangalia ile ngari iko karibu kujandi wanaingia. Hata uangalie inaenda inaenda kajado ama inaenda wapi? Hallelujah! Ingia ngari ya kwako. Bwana asifiwe. Hata kama ila watu. Be focused. Hallelujah! There are people in the church only go with the crowd. Eh, yeah, crowd. Kama my friends are going, we are going. You came to this world alone. We shall live alone. Be focused. Hata kama uko kwa evangelism team na team be alone hata ukiwa hapo hata ukiwa kwa choir hata ukiwa kwa worship be focused hallelujah hey praise god now i finish jesus amen what is there another word there can you pick another word there this one's i'm going just to give you like a highlight it says what endured so to, to get to the turning point you must do what and you are okay i don't want to say and you are what the cross okay the other one there is what despising what if you are going to get to the turning point you must also accept to do what to do the despise of shame people will despise you atasema hii kitu mnafanya ni kitu gani sasa hii fuck hii kitu nafanya hapa hii biashara ulianza unaona kama wewe utaweza kweli hey watu wengi walijaribu shame hallelujah you have to go through all those frustrations. Hallelujah. Amen. Verse 3. Contradiction. Yeah, if you are going to get to, to, your, to your whatever, you are going to go through contradiction. People will, uh, you will contradict. People will be contradicted. Accept for contradiction. They are going to be there. They, they, they what? The contradiction of sinners. Hallelujah. Again, at least you be wearied and what? Faint. Watch those two things. Weird, being weird, being weird and fainting. Many people don't get to their turning point because they do what? They get weary and they do what? They faint. Hallelujah. They get discouraged. They wear out. They get finished. Tell your neighbor, don't get finished. Push on. Hallelujah. Somebody said, if you cannot fly, run. If you cannot run, walk. If you cannot walk, crawl. Hallelujah. But you must get there. You must get there. Bwana asifiwe. Hallelujah. Praise the name of Jesus. Those are things that you're going to find. That's four. You have not what? Resisted. A turning point shall be what? Resisted. There will be resistance. Hallelujah. As you go through the turning, it's a journey. I'm just giving you a journey of turning point. There will be what? Resistance. 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 Things don't just come. There will be resistance. Hallelujah. But the Bible says, Hallelujah. Amen. Persistence, whereas what? Resistance. Persistence, whereas what? 
resistance. I've been coming here, coming here, coming here. Hey, when I started coming to the ministry, there was resistance. But I can continue coming, coming, coming. Hallelujah. There is persistence. It can answer question resistance in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Praise the name of Jesus. There will be resistance. Hey, hallelujah. Verse 6. I just want to give you a highlight. Kidogo, kidogo. Hey, I'm finishing. 6 says what? Amen. For whom the Lord chastened, love it, he does what? He scorches. In the journey of a turning point, there will be what? There will be scorching. Hallelujah. Amen. There will be, the Lord may scourge you. Hallelujah. There may be correction. There, verse 6. The father collected the sons he loved. There will be correction. Hallelujah. Praise the name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Verse 12. Hallelujah. Wherefore, lift what? Verse 12. Lift what? The hands which are down and feeble. As we go out in the, looking for this, it, reach, it may reach to a place where the hands may come down. But the Lord is bringing encouragement to you. I'm speaking to the ones who are discouraged. These are, this is discouragement. This is a sign of chapter verse 12 speaking about Elijah. Kill me, Lord. Kill me. Kill me now. Well, it's better I die. <laughs> Hallelujah! Discouragement. The Lord says what? Lift up those hands which are hung down and the feeble knees. You need to take courage in the journey of turning point. In the name of Jesus. Verse 15. Looking diligently let any man fall out what? Fall of the grace of God. Hallelujah. In the journey of turning point, don't lose the grace of God. Don't lose the grace. It's a journey of grace. Turning point requires a grace. Don't lose the grace. Don't fall from the grace. You need the grace of God. And the grace comes what? Least the what? Least the root of bitterness comes in. Sometimes you get discouraged, you get bitter. Start even bitter, bitter with God. You start even bitter with the people because you are not turning point. Hallelujah. And the bitterness shall take away grace of God from your life. Don't allow the grace of God to depart from you. Hallelujah. Amen. Glory to God. I finish. Hallelujah. We go. Hallelujah. Verses 24. As I finish. And Jesus. And you have come to Jesus, the mediator, and the new covenant. The blood that is sprinkling and speaks better things than the blood than Abel. We have come to a place of the covenant. We have a covenant with God. Every time as you walk in this journey of the turning point, now we have a covenant with God. We have a covenant of better things, of better things than the, than the, than the blood of Abel. God has promised better things. There's what is ahead. There's a joy. The Bible says, Jesus faced everything for the joy that was before him. Brothers and sisters, as we come to the turning point, there will be joy. Maybe today we are going through sorrow. But as we come to the turning point, there will be joy. And the Lord says, we have a promise of better things. Hallelujah. Praise the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Therefore, verse 25, 5. See that you refuse not him that speaketh. In the journey of turning point, listen to the Lord. Don't lose the voice of God. Do not lose the voice of God. Do not lose the voice of God. Tell your neighbor, do not lose the voice of God. It doesn't matter whether things are hard. But the Bible says here, See that you refuse not him that speaketh. There's a voice that God will need to speak. And you need to keep that voice with you because it will bring you to the turning point. Praise God. Carry that voice with you. Carry the voice you heard from the beginning. Don't lose what the Lord said in the beginning. A lot of time we lose the voice which God spoke in the beginning. Hallelujah. Every time in the ministry I go through many problems. I always remember what the Lord told me about Karen. 
Hallelujah. I always go back to the beginning. What did the Lord say about you being here? Friends, I had the Lord calling me here. Hallelujah. It was not because there were people, but because of the agenda of God. And therefore, even when we are in trouble, you need to go back to what the Lord said to you in the beginning. Even when you are going through a problem with your wife and your husband, go back to the beginning. <laughs> to the beginning. What did the Lord say to you when you married her? Hallelujah. That day I was talking to some people who are having problems with each other. I said, let us go to the beginning. Is it the will of the Lord that you married each other? Then the lady said, you know, Yeah, but the brother said, oh, yeah, I had the Lord. I had the Lord. Okay, okay. And then the brother, did you, the sister, did you hear the Lord? Bishop, I don't, I, I can, I, I, ha, huh. hallelujah. What I know is that I had joy when I accepted. So was this the Lord? Yeah, it was the Lord. For sure, I confirmed it was the Lord. The problem that there is problem today does not mean it was not the Lord. Go back to the beginning. The Lord spoke about it. And today, you need to continue hearing the voice of God. God has a voice. God will never be silenced. Even in the midst of the trouble, the voice of God is still there. Hallelujah. The journey of the turning point. The Bible says we have come to the mountain. Hey, we have come to the mountain. Hallelujah. We have come to the mountain of God. In the last verse here, he said, we have come to the mountain of God. And we have come to Jesus Christ. And we have come, hallelujah, to him that is able to make all things possible. Verse 28 and last one. Wherefore, receiving the kingdom which cannot be moved, let us have what? Grace, whereby we may serve God acceptably and with reference and a godly fear. Praise God. As we come to the turning point, God is going to bring us to the turning point. And it's going to come. We are, the turning point will be the kingdom of God. The turning point will be receiving the kingdom of God. Whatever we shall receive is the kingdom of God. God wants to give us the kingdom. Hallelujah, that cannot be shaken. The turning point is God ushering you to the grace of God. I said at the beginning that I dreamt last night God releasing abundance of his kingdom to, to us, to men and the women. The Lord is speaking to you today. and say that God, let us have received the grace. And then in the morning, Mama came here and said, she spoke prophetically here in the morning also. She never knew what the Lord was, was going to preach. But she said, she preached, and you will be from Deuteronomy 28. And she said, when you have come to the land and you have eaten and you have drunk, do not forget the Lord. What is the relationship? The Lord is bringing us to the abundance. The Lord is bringing us to the turning point. The Lord has given you the journey. But when you have come and eaten and you have abundance, thou shalt not forget the Lord. Shall we stand in prayer before God? Shall we stand before God in prayer? The worship leaders, be prepared to sing, to read us a song in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 <laughs> Oh,
worship God with our offering of our tithes. There's a song that we sang earlier. There's a song about the goodness of God. Hallelujah. The goodness of God. Hallelujah. We want us to sing the goodness of God because I sense the goodness of God is going to be with us. I sense the goodness of God. Hallelujah. Praising the name of Jesus. And that may the goodness of God follow you, pursue you. A singer song is the goodness of the Lord is pursue is, is what? Huh? Is is running after me. Yes, Lord. Your goodness is running after. Is running after me. Your goodness is running after. Is running after me. Your goodness is running after. Is running after me.
to shine over your life. May he, fight, may he give you favor. Hallelujah. Glory to God. May you see the goodness of God in this week. Hallelujah. Praise God. Amen. Tangazo maalum. Tunajenga turukana. Kanisa tunajenga turukana. Amen. Amen. Najua mwatoa mwatoa sadaka na fungu la kumi. Nataka pesa ya tukana hapa leo. Tunaanza kujenga we are building a big orphanage there. Na tumeanza tumepata shamba ya 250 tumelipia hiyo. Hii week tumeanza kujenga. Bwana asifiwe. Hallelujah. We have been given a very good offer by the Combustion International. They said we finish building by end of October. They will give us, they will support with us for children in Tukana. Bwana asifiwe. And they said, if you don't finish, we shall take that elsewhere. You understand me? You know my agency now. Kwa hivyo nataka pesa sasa ya Tukana. Katika jina la Yesu. Amen. Hallelujah. Nili maliza. Tuliko tulianza na 75,000. Mjengo inaendelea. Hii wiki tunataka about 40,000. Tuendelea na mjengo. Iishe tuweke mabati. Tuliwaambia tutamaliza before them. We will finish before them. Kwa hivyo nataka pesa na tii yangu ni aturukana. Tumalize hapo. Bwana asifiwe. After that we shall all go there and see what God is doing in Turukana. By the grace of God. Najengea watoto. Nataka kuwa na project ya watoto kubwa sana. Ya kureisi watoto watukana Mbao wako hali mbaya Kwa hivyo nataka katika jina la Yesu Kristo Hiyo ni mimi napogea Hata hiyo hindi kwa kikabu Hiyo ni napogea tu In Jesus name Saa hii na hile ingine Kama una pesa Eka kwa mpesa Andika turukana hapo In Jesus name Halalu mwambie mwenzako lazima uusike Na turukana katika jina la Yesu Amen Nataka kutoa unabisa, nataka tutabiri kwa anjili ya wiki hii na guja. This week is a going to be a week of victory. Hallelujah. I'm sensing mambo ina, inakuwa mazuri, mazuri. Mwambie mwazako, just speak a word of blessing to your neighbor. Hey, Mwambie hii wiki mbisho wanazema utabarikiwa. Utabarikiwa. Mungu wa kufungulie milango. In Jesus name. Hallelujah. Mambo yako yawe sawa. Kue na neema. Mam. Hallelujah. Thank you Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Yani mungu, yani kitu kifanyike. Hallelujah. Amen. Kuna ushindi wa jabu. Hallelujah. Kuna ushindi wa jabu. Hallelujah. Kuna ushindi ushindi. Hallelujah. Kuna ushindi wa jabu. Hallelujah. 
it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses. As we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us on temptation. But deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Amen. Speak the word of grace to your neighbor. The word of grace. By the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, the fellowship of the Holy Spirit, be with us now and forevermore. Amen.